Pisho Hala. Hello, dear friends. This one is a, a <coughs> calligraphy book, and uh, some friends ask me about calligraphy book. This one is uh, for for use, Qing Shao Nian, for the young people, a training. But actually, the character, the writing itself is uh, there is no age different. It's just. Uh, uh, make it very easy understanding and use very simple Chinese language, so <clears throat> so it's for for the use. It's really not for young people or old people. Calligraphy is good for everybody, right? And this one is Yan Ti style, Yan Zhen Qing style, and uh, it instruct stroke by stroke. So we learn this kind of stroke, Xie <coughs> Pi. And the application in different in different uh, character, and uh, so lesson one is uh, is uh, heng. Lesson two, chang heng long, and lesson two, lesson three, lesson four. It's a vertical line. Five, and let me see how many lessons we have. Forty eight. 56, 58, totally uh, 60 lessons. So it's, it goes through every character. And for this size of, uh, of uh, character, you use a large, I think you have uh, bought one of the white, large white cloud. It is appropriate size for this. And when you use calligraphy, writing calligraphy, always buy a brush or use a brush larger than the character. In the way that uh, if you use a, a, a brush, a medium sized brush, you can, of course, you can write into large size, but it use too much and it takes too much of the brush and uh, and um, and stretch it to the ex to the to to the extreme it is not good for the brush and it's not good for for the best use of the brush so this one you use a large chinese uh, white cloud brush large size is good and it's quite uh, elegant style this is yan ti yan zhen qing style and here is another book. It's almost the same. It's just a different. Uh, it's from different uh, in carving, and this is the character from another, another in carving stone, and uh, also totally. Let me see. Eighty, sixty characters. Almost, almost the same, same thing. But I feel this character has more uh, stop. Up, down, up, down, and this one has more uh, smoothness. Looks like there are two differences. And uh, if you want to have, I, I suggest, uh, if you like have two, of course you can get two, but one is already sufficient if a budget is a concern. And this one is also mm, the Yan Zhen Qing, but it's a, in a much, much, larger style, a uh, larger character, you can see. And this one you will need to use uh, a larger than than um, white cloud. Let me see this side. This side is a little bit too large, but uh, use a really, a little bit too large, but use a really large brush. Large white cloud will help like this. This is also a very beautiful and elegant. I remember when I was young mm. and uh, my father, my parents, they used this kind of calligraphy book and uh, and they bought this calligraphy book for us to practice. And I feel all this white with black and then I show to my father. And uh, and I told my parents how proud I am. I feel them up. <laughs> they were quite, <laughs> they were quite, um, quite uh, not happy at that time. They were, <laughs> yeah. So it is not supposed to be used that way. Anyway, so this is a beautiful calligraphy book also, and this one is Liu Gongquan style. It's already uh, written into. 
beautiful Chinese uh, Chinese、um, Chinese writing, Chinese like poetry, like phrase. And this one is Tang Ti style. It's a, a medium sized carriage and also very beautiful and elegant. So <clears throat> all these books.、Um, If you are interested, I will later on put on onto my my、uh, Etsy shop. But uh, uh, if you want to have any of these, please let me know so that、uh, you can have it before it is sold out. Okay. Thank you very much. I still have a couple of others. I will find them and then、um, do a video of it. But、uh, otherwise, you just、uh, oh, this one is also phrases, beautiful phrases.、Mm. Otherwise,、uh, mm. take a look at this and uh, and uh, enjoy. Thank you very much.